Mason is selling a lens, so we're going to do that now. I'm gonna fall over. Boom! And I wish that I could buy all of the things that he's purchased, but I can't. I would really like to put the lens you're selling on my work camera. Yeah? It would look so good. This is the lens he's selling, a 50 millimeter 1.4 because he doesn't have a Canon anymore. This is seriously like the best lens. It looks so good. If you have one, you know, but like, wow. We're trying to be adults and get our own phone plan. So we're at Verizon. We're not getting one today though. I need a new phone, it's OT, but it's not working out. So here we are. Okay, bye. We're going inside, so I'm gonna. The guy was like gripping his truck. I uh, forgot to take my camera into Target. I'm so good at this. How are you doing? Driving. How? Good. Good. I'm gonna check my mail when I get back to my apartment. I'm trying to decide if I want to buy an iPhone X with Verizon or buy an iPhone X on the marketplace. If you're selling an iPhone 10 for less than a thousand dollars, hit me up. Thanks. I would like to make a correction to that last statement for less than $800. Hit me up. My Insta is Hunter Merck. Thanks. Does your computer ever just not do anything? Ignore how dirty the screen is. It's being dumb. It's alive. It, I just took it off the charger. I don't know what's wrong with it. So I'm on my way to the mailbox. I am a compulsive mail checker. I check my mailbox literally all the time. And um, Mason decided to redo my hair. I had it in just a bun because I always just put it in a bun when I get home. And so he redid my hair for me. And he braided the back of it. And I'm very impressed because I didn't know that he knew how to braid. Only complaint is this is a lot of hair. Like a smaller piece would be nice, yeah? Or like tucked in a little bit? I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm going to the mailbox and we're waiting on some pizza because we just ordered some pizza from Papa John's. So, I'm gonna hold it at this angle, so. Let's see, I can't see anything because these hairs are on my face. Oh, it's actually not super cloudy right now, which I'm impressed by, there's a person. So I'm gonna go away for a second. We were just casually sitting on our computers and then we realized we had to go pick up our pizza. Well, I was waiting on you because it said that it, it would send you something. I think it said it was going to text me, but then it didn't. So, we're just going to go and hope that it's ready. And if it's not, I think Mason might be mad at me. But it's fine, so... He was coming downstairs really fast behind me, so I had to speed up. So, we ordered pizza, right? Oh, is it in focus? Maybe. Um, and she ordered it with my card, and she put her name instead of mine, so I make her go and get it out of the store, and it's really hard for her, so she doesn't know I'm doing this. You'll see this in your footage. I love you. So first things first, and the most important, I have the pizza. And I'm telling Mason the story too while I'm telling you the video, I mean. Um, so basically, the curb um, was supposed to be flat, but it was uneven on the sidewalk. So I nearly ate the ground. I'm really glad no one saw it because I don't think anybody in Papa John's was paying attention or noticed that I nearly died. But all is well. It was a very, very small curve. It was like this big, but it was still enough to trip me. Quite literally trip me. And now my leg hurts kinda, cause I like slammed down really hard trying to stop myself from falling. <laughs> There's this thing happening right here. There's a lot of doggos over here. What's happening? There's a lot of dogs over here. I'd like to know what's happening. 
So we got two medium pizzas and mine is a spinach alfredo sauce with cheese, obviously, and chicken and Canadian bacon. And I think there's something else, but I can't remember. So Mason's editing some pictures. Look, it's me. We have this coupon for buy one, get one free. Ask them if they say coupon or coupon. Regular waffle cone. Also, Mason and I have been having this debate. Do you call it a coupon or a coupon? I call it coupon and he calls it coupon. And there's literally no way to spell it out how you say it. So do you say it like Mason, coupon, or Hunter, coupon? Comment that down below, please, because I'm curious. Um, yeah, but we have this coupon, so we're going to get some waffle cones because it's literally like not even a mile down the road. The voltage is normal. Bluetooth disconnect. Someone's, oh, these people's windows are open. Those windows right there are open. And I was just like shouting. The people who live below me, oh gosh, I want to ask them if I annoy them. Oops. We're going to need a minute. Um, we're gonna get a, uh, two waffle cones. Um, one is gonna have the, um, let it's me just... It's a new uh, cookie something or other. It's not on there. Or one's gonna have the chocolate chip cookie dough in it. What's the second one? Um, Oreo. And the second one has Oreo in it. Um, what size? It's BOGO, so it doesn't matter what size, it just. Regular. Uh, that'll be it. Look at this beautiful ice cream cone. I got Oreo, and he got cookie dough. It's like minty. Ooh, I'm so excited to eat this. So I've decided to sell my trusty Nikon. There's nothing wrong with it, I just don't use it. I just put it in my camera bag and it had dust on it because I haven't used it in months. It's what I started my YouTube career with. It has a flip out screen and everything. And yeah, a Nikon D5200 if you guys are interested in starting a YouTube channel, you should buy my camera because yeah. I have a new camera with my job and it's really fancy and expensive so I'm using that until I can upgrade to my dream camera and Mason's gonna take some pics of it for me to post on the Facebook marketplace